The next acid I want to talk about is our mandelic peel. This is considered a superficial peel or a level one. It can penetrate down to the stratum spinosum. Don't worry, <laughs> this isn't deep, but it is a bit deeper than the lactic acid can travel. The absolute beauty of this acid is that it really isn't that irritating at all. People love how easy it is to apply and how low the irritation is. Remember, there's no need to be in pain to get results. The most common description is just a tingling or a very mild irritation. Now we have two percentages available. And as with any acid, if you are unsure, always start with a milder percentage and work your way up. Mandelic 22%, which is right here, can work well for those that have sensitive skin. And this includes teens and tweens, as well as anyone with rosé shock. Apply at least one full peel series of six to eight peels before you jump up to the 40%. For tweens, a one-time application every two weeks works well. For adults, one time per week is good. So if you're an adult, have problematic acne, or have performed other peels in the past, you can definitely start with a 40%. You shouldn't have any problems at all. If you have rosacea though, always stay with the 22%. As you can maybe guess, this acid is excellent for acne, and that's why I mentioned the younger crowd. It has antibacterial properties to fight pimples and will help to keep the follicles clear. It's also excellent for those dealing with melasma, hyperpigmentation, PIH, which was that post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation and darker skin types, and fine lines. This will give you tiny little baby flakes, not super obtrusive in any way. What a super acid. This is one of my very favorites and one of the most common peels we suggest for those calling in for help on just about any issue. Thank you.